Good evening. What's the weather in your area? Um, people to the car when you have a in the planning. In the I am not going to be directly how I can the first one. I am not going to be in the I am not going to be in the Algunos compañeros de ustedes que en su área está también de bien en el cuerpo. Sí, teacher, no sé si solamente a mí me pasa, pero el audio no se escucha bien. No sé si soy yo o habrá una interferencia. Está bien cortado. Se escucha a lo lejos. Hola, hola. Hola, hola. No, igual. Sí, Ticho, yo lo sigo escuchando igual, no sé si solamente soy yo. Debió haber cambiado, le digo. Ahora se escucha mejor. Sí, he activado otro micrófono. Esperando se pueda oír mejor. Solo me van reportando si es así. Sí, dicho, ahora se escucha mejor. Ok. Ok, thank you. Ok, como les dije, esperemos que la tormenta no nos afecte, ya que si nos afecta, eso es un atraso en la fecha de, de finalización. Entonces, esperemos que eso no suceda.
Okay, uh, we hope to finish this week, uh, the next Wednesday. Quizá voy a usar mis auriculares porque acá ya llueve muy fuerte. Y ya no les estoy oyendo nada. Okay, un segundo, por favor. Okay, I'm almost ready. Okay, here we go. Let me check out the attendance first in order to start now. Okay, I got it here. America Elizabeth, are you there? Present teacher. Okay, I hope that you feel better. Espero se sienta bien. Ya mejor. Okay, un segundito que el sistema está lento.
Yeah, you probably don't understand me. Bueno, aquí vamos. Carlos Amilcar. Present. Cecilia Maribel. Present. Ok, welcome. Edwin Alexis. Present teacher. Ok, welcome. Edwin Alfredo. Edwin Alfredo. No, here, okay. Um, Esmeralda del Rosario. Present teacher. Okay. Eh, Gabriela Yamilet. Present teacher. Okay, got it. Gisela Guadalupe. Gisela Guadalupe. Héctor Enrique. Present teacher. Okay. Eh, Ingrid Geraldina. Present. Okay. Jonathan. Present teacher. Okay. Uh, José Ernesto. Don José Ernesto, Catherine Paola, Catherine Paola, Kenny Natalie, present teacher. Okay. Eh, Mauricio Antonio. Mauricio Antonio. Mercedes Alejandra. Present teacher. Roxana. Present teacher. Roxana Elizabeth. Present teacher. Sara Alejandra. Sara. Teacher. Hello. Present teacher. Okay. Sergio Adolfo. Present teacher. Okay. Janet. Present teacher. Y Yesenia Lisset. Present teacher. Okay, welcome. Bueno, ahí tenemos ya eh, listo y preparado lo eh, que vamos a hacer el día de hoy. So, uh, we are going to start now. Waiting that. That the power. Uh, and keep in order that we can continue working there, okay? 
Okay, let me share it. Okay, this is a uh, English for word program, basic module three. This is section four. And the topic for today is vocabulary practice. Welcome to all of you. It is a pleasure to see you again. I hope that all of you feel really good in order that you can get all the information that we are going to share with you. Okay, we are going to start talking about these questions. But today I'm going to ask directly to someone of you, I'm going to say your name and you are going to answer, right? I'm going to give you uh, time in order that you can answer. It. The first question that we have is, what are city personal values you transfer to your interaction with the worker? That is the first question. And the second one said, do the company's values impact employees? and how, okay. First of all, take a look at the first question. What are city personal values you transfer to your interactions with coworkers? And the second one, do the company's values impact employees and how? Okay, let us start talking about the three personal values you transfer uh, to your interaction with your work. Okay, before to stop sharing, um, I don't know if you have any question related with this, maybe a word that you don't have any idea that, about the meaning? Just let me know, please. Hello? Hello, hello? Well, I'm going to stop sharing. You can find this question in uh, on page number 13, I guess. It's there. Okay, any question related with uh with this one? No? No, teacher. I okay, understand no the question. Okay, I'm going to ask. Uh, to someone, uh, this the first one. Uh, let us see who is going to be the one that is going to answer it. Okay. Um, what about you, Janet? Could you answer the first question, please? Hello. No idea? No. Okay. Uh, what about, bueno, los que están de oyentes es porque están ocupados haciendo algo más. Let me see, what about you, Sara? Ah, está de oyente también. Okay, bueno, entonces, uh, let me see, Sergio, what can you tell me about the first question? Uh, the first question? Yeah, the first one. Uh, I think that the three important values, uh, uh, leadership, Okay. Uh, responsibility. Responsibility. Okay. And integrity. 
and in charity. Yes. Okay, thank you. Let me see someone else who wants to answer this question. Let me see who is the one that is going to tell me something. What about you, Hector? Uh, what, what can you tell me about, Hector? In the first question, yes. I usually help my co-worker with support cast. Oh, okay. Okay, thank you. Let me see someone else. What about you, uh, Carlos Amilcar? Yeah, I think that three values can be uh, responsibility, okay. respect, and solidarity. Solidarity, okay. Empathy. Empathy could be two. Okay, okay. okay. Okay, thank you. Um, let us talk about the second one. Hablemos de la segunda ahora. Do the company's values impact employees? And how? Somebody wants to tell me. Do the company's values impact employees and how? I'm talking about your maybe your own company uh, in the one that you work. Do you consider that uh, the values impact to you and how? Tell me. Only one, only one, please. Solo uno, no más. Solo uno, answer the question. Me? Yes, uh, because they are a basic of a good company. Okay. I'm going to show you again the question in order that you get familiar with it. Do the company's values impact employees and how? That means that in every company we can find some values and how they impact in employees. What can you tell me about? In other words, in Spanish, como los valores de la compañía impactan en sus empleados. Chao. Teacher. Hello. Um, in my case, uh, my co-worker demonstrate responsibility and um, get work are the planned activity to ensure. And, and we are efficient all the, uh, all the, my workplace to ensure. Okay. Okay, thank you. Let me see someone who wants to say something about these questions. Teacher. Hello, Candy. In my case, Chase Troop and entertainment and by nat natural. Because they are values that help me in contract to excel. Share track. Okay. Someone else? Mm, 
me teacher. Okay, Gaby. Uh, in my case, I I respect every everybody, and I don't have this discrimination oh, okay. with the other person. Okay, thank you. No se le escucha, teacher. Hola, 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 hola. Sí, ahora sí. Okay. Sí. Ahora sí. Sí, es que acá por la lluvia está generándome un, un feedback. Entonces tengo que usar los auriculares para evitar el, el sonido ambiente. So, uh, let us continue talking about this. And exploring, what, you, what do you think about this? Because we are talking about values. Estamos hablando de valores. So, uh, we had two questions, as I already told you. And what I need is that you interact with me and you tell me, answer these three questions. The first one, what are the three personal values you transfer to your interaction with co-worker? And the second one, do the company's values impact employees and how? Just let me know, what do you think? You, some of you mentioned some uh, specific detail and values related with these two questions, but I need more comments about Hello. Ahora les pregunto algo así en español. Eh, but be honest and tell me the truth. ¿Será que a estas alturas... Si usted no le menciona su nombre, no participa. Le pregunto, ¿será necesario que yo le esté mencionando su nombre? No, teacher. Ah, ok. No, teacher. No, les pregunto esto porque alguien puede pensar diferente. Claro, yo podría tener una ruleta donde tengo todos sus nombres, tengo que esperar que dé tres, cinco vueltas. Eh, pero por eso les pregunto. Ahora, yo siempre trato de dejar abierto la oportunidad para que todos puedan expresar lo que piensan. Entonces, espero de que aprovechemos todos la oportunidad para poder hacerlo. Ahora les menciono esto porque posiblemente alguien esté pensando y dice, no, mientras no me llame, yo no voy a responder. Pero aquí creo que ya estamos grandecitos. Y entre más participa usted, más desarrolla eh, las habilidades en el idioma. Entonces, yo no les voy a decir que me las sé todas, pero he trabajado desde parvularia hasta nivel universitario. Y sé la forma de trabajo con los infantes, que es sumamente diferente, a trabajar ya con la mayoría de, de, de personas adultas, que ya no es la pedagogía, sino la andragogía la que hace sus efectos. ¿Verdad? Entonces, yo les pido de favor que para que hagamos más ameno esto, eh, podamos interactuar todos yo voy buscando la participación activa, ya le dije si usted participa eh, 
pues vamos a hacer esto con, con más sabor, con más feeling. Pero de repente si yo hago una pregunta y nadie me responde, y alguien va a decir, ay, no, es que el teacher es el aburrido. Entonces ahí habría que valorar, porque la pregunta está hecha. ¿Y para quién? Para todos los de la clase. Así que pongamos, por favor, de nuestra parte para que salgamos muy bien. Ok, teacher. Ok. Teacher, teacher, how to pronounce contribute? Contribuir. Contribute. Oh, the development contribute to their workplace earning potential and better career progression. Is correct my idea, teacher? Yes, it's correct. Oh, your idea. Okay. Your idea. Because all, all depend on the values that you are going to develop in your shop and that way uh, you are going to uh, get results. Okay. And, and for example, teacher, in my in my workplace, um, 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 I want opportunity for a better career progression. Okay. Um, sería, ¿cómo se, se, se diría el puesto? Ascender a un puesto, teacher. La oportunidad de ascender a un puesto. How do you say in English? The opportunity to get a, a new position, get a rise in your job. Eso es como incluso hasta tener un aumento, not only just talking about economic details, but also uh, in a different position. To grow, to grow out. Tiene la, la oportunidad de crecer en, 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 en la compañía. But so, oh, okay. Yeah, but, but sometimes in, in, in other places, uh, it's different, you know. Okay, teacher, thank you. Okay, you're welcome. Recuerden que algunos tenemos auriculares. El sonido ambiente tenemos que ir controlando. Okay, okay, let us continue then. If you, anybody else wants to talk about just let me know about that. Okay, so I told you uh, you can find this information in your material on page number 13 and 14, I guess. Is, is the right one. Let me check up here. Yes. I'm, I, I'm in the right. But let us continue talking about this. Today we are going to talk about values. Hoy hablaremos bastante sobre los valores que cada uno tenemos. And I got uh, another question for you in order that you can interact. Como dije, eh, generalmente los que están de oyentes no les pregunto porque desde el momento que ponen de estar de oyentes es porque están ocupaditos en otra cosa. Okay, I got a few questions right here. What are core values? Let us focus our attention in the few questions. Centremos nuestra atención primero en la pregunta uno. What are core values? As soon as we got an answer, we can continue with the second one. And later on, let us talk about the third ones. Okay, give me an answer about the third one, please. What are core values? Okay, I'm going to stop in order to interact better with you. Just let me know what do you think about. Teacher, I think I am. in the personal teacher, the best value is personal ethic. Okay. 
Okay. Because making a good decision in the worst place. Okay. That means that you are going to be honest. You are going oh. to be responsible. And and solving problem, teacher. Solving problem, okay. Yes, because um, we need to be open-minded in order that we can resolve or be part of the solution of the problem, not just to increase it. But sometimes it's really difficult because uh, we just see uh, error from another people, but not about ourselves. Teacher. Hello. Cuando dicen professional goal, ¿a qué se refieren? Yo he escuchado esa palabra con, con eso de, del significado de ética. Professional goal. Professional goal. Sí. ¿A qué se refieren? Generalmente son eh, como objetivos profesionales, metas profesionales. Ok, teacher. Gracias. Uh, in order to reach uh, then uh, we need to to develop some values in order to do that y para poder alcanzar esas metas esos objetivos tenemos que tener ciertos valores that is really really important that is the, the, the reason why we are talking about that today because in our job um Maybe uh, we don't like the people that is in front of us, our boss, but we need to recognize that he, if he or she is there, it's because there is a reason. And we need to respect it. Algunas veces podría suceder que no estamos tranquilos o a gusto por la persona que está dirigiéndonos en la empresa pero debe de haber alguna razón por la cual él está de jefe. Y algunas veces quisiésemos que él haga lo que nosotros pensamos, pero él tiene otra óptica y ahí es donde entramos en controversia. And we need to respect each other. Y necesitamos respetarnos mutuamente. And that way we are going to increase. And, and also our company is going to develop in a better way. Y por lo tanto, si el personal está con buenas relaciones, la compañía también va a crecer. Okay, what else? Uh, I think that respect is a uh, important value for the company too. Uh, respect help to people interact, interact well. Okay, interact, 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 interact. Okay, and the people too can add more values uh, a partir del respect. Okay. That means that based on the respect, people is going to develop another values. That is what okay. you, you say. Okay. 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 Thank you. As you can see, uh, what you think is really important right here. Se dan cuenta, sus ideas son muy importantes, pero necesito que las compartan. Es necesario poder compartir lo que usted piensa. Me teacher. Okay, Esmeralda. Uh, I think uh, principles that define our behavior as people. Okay. That is really important, that word that you said. <coughs> how, how we are going to behave in our job with uh, our co-worker and even with our principal or supervisor. Uh, we need to behave in the right way, you know. Maybe we could be close friends, 
but in our job, we are going to respect each other. We are not going to irrespect the others. Me comprenden lo que acabo de decirle, sí. Fui entendido. Ya escucho. What about the rest? Yeah, ciertas partes, pero en no, otras no. no. Ah, ok. ¿Cuáles no? Yeah, si podría repetir, por favor. Well, what I'm saying, lo que estoy diciendo es, the way that we behave, de la forma como nos comportemos in our job, en nuestros trabajos, that is going to talk about us, because eso va a hablar de nosotros, ya que our boss or maybe our co-worker, they are going to have a, a concept about everyone. De la manera que nos comportamos, nuestros jefes, nuestros compañeros van a tener un concepto de cada uno de nosotros. Y dirán, that we are respectful or irrespectful. You know? Y ellos van a decir, ah, fulano es muy obediente. Fulana no es muy obediente. So, has to do with, with, with values too, you know? Ok, let me see. Tengo una pregunta, pero creo que por la lluvia no se me escucha. Ok, writing down, Sergio. Sergio, are you there, Sergio? Sergio, Sergio. Ah, why the, the, the word curve? Ah, it's a good question, sir. En este contexto. Ah, ok. Yo sé que significa núcleo. Ok. Is one of the meaning. ¿Qué más dice? Ok. Remember, uh, let me tell you this. Uh, every, every time that you move to another level, you are going to find out that a word can have more than three or five minutes. All depend on the context and all depend on the area too. Cada vez que nos movemos a un nivel diferente, vamos a ir dando, dándonos cuenta que eh, las palabras van teniendo significados eh, como diferentes dependiendo del contexto. En este caso, lo que él menciona es el porqué de la palabra cur en este contexto. Él mismo menciona ahí y dice, yo sé que es el núcleo, pero eh, ¿por qué en este contexto? Bueno, es simple porque estamos hablando de valores fundamentales en el ser humano y en este caso en lo profesional que debemos de ser cada uno de nosotros. Por eso se llama así, core values. Cuando ya habla usted de núcleo, estamos hablando de algo fundamental. That is the reason why. Por ahí no sé si, si, si le respondí, eh, si se quedó comprendido, me, me hace ahí por favor una manito o si todavía hay, no está claro también. I can uh, reinforce. Okay, ahí está. Okay, let us continue then. I don't know if somebody else uh, have another question. No sé si alguien más tenga otra pregunta relacionada con esto. Ya dije, eh, eso de core values son como valores fundamentales. Esa sería como la traducción. Then I go like that you tell me at least uh, every one of you could give me one of the values that you consider core. Okay, let me see. Y que no se repita ninguno. Por ejemplo, Carlos, tell me one. One value that you consider is important. Carlos. Uh, could, could be see 
could be solidarity. Ah, it's solidarity. Okay. What about Ingrid? Tell me one. Come on, Ingrid. Think so. My core value uh, is respectful. Okay, be respectful with this. Okay. Thank you, Hector. What about you, Hector? Hector, just, just tell me one. The loyalty. Loyalty, okay. It's, it's, a, it's a excellent. Gabi, what about you? Humility, teacher. Not think that, that I am more than my other who you are you talking about equity? Okay. Hello, are you there? Se nos pon hello el audio. O solo sure. fue. Okay. Uh, what about Roxana? Roxana, tell me Roxana. Uh, in work. Rocks, tell me. Teamwork. Ah, teamwork. Okay, trabajo en equipo, muy bien. Uh, let us see. Uh, bueno, ya dije que los que están de oyentes no les hago preguntas porque están ocupados en algo más. Me, teacher. Okay, Esmeralda. Eh, loyalty. Okay, ya lo mencionaron. Eh, solidarity. Solidarity. Okay. Roxana Landa Verde, where are you? Honesty. Honesty, light the sun, okay. Uh, Cecilia. Cecilia. Kindness. Kindness, okay. Gisela. Mm, um... For example, uh -huh. Bali oh, work, working hard. Hard working? Hard working, yes. Mm. Okay. Mm, sure. Okay, tell, tell me, Edwin. Mm, personality. Ah, okay. Uh, eso es importante, lo que acaba de hacer Edwin Alexis. Si él está de oyente y quiere participar, simple y sencillamente abre su micrófonito y vamos hacia adelante. En mi caso, ya les dije, yo siempre respeto cuando ustedes tienen esa palabra ahí, porque supongo que están en alguna situación eh, que no les es tan factible el poder estar interactuando, pero el que lo pueda hacer, por favor, no duden en hacerlo. Ya dije, la oportunidad es para todos ustedes. Ok, let us continue with the next questions. Continuemos con la siguiente pregunta. Ok, the second one say, why are they important to a company? Why are they important to a company? Uh, talking about core values. ¿Por qué son importantes en una compañía? Ok. Será, será to work as a team. Ah, to work as a team. Could be. Ok. Ok. Thank you, somebody else. ¿Alguien más? Hola. Okay, Sergio. Sergio, repeat again because it's difficult to get all the information. No sé si solo soy yo el que le estoy oyendo entrecortado. O los demás también me confirman para ver si es mi señal la que está no está bien. Si se le escucha mal, teacher. 
Sí, se escucha mal, muy, muy bajo y corto y cortado, cortado. Sí, difícil de poder comprender. Sergio, si gusta, escriba a, ahí en el, en el chat. Ok, dice, because help us. Mitch, ay, se me, me lo pasó. Vamos a ver, vamos a ver. Ok, hold on a second. Vamos a, vamos a irnos al chat para poder leerlo muy bien. Because help us meet goals and object it. Ah, ok. Si es que está lloviendo en su zona, posiblemente esté lloviendo fuerte, ¿cierto? Ok, thank you. Okay, some, someone else, someone else, please. Teacher, okay, teacher. Oh, the foundation of the company is the valors. The values? Oh, the values. Values, sorry, values. Values. Yes. Yeah, as I told you before, that is the reason why we, we say core values core values por eso son los valores fundamentales ok, son Wenel alguien más no eh, the so, company values eh, are important because help to to employees to follow the mission of the company Ah, okay. You mentioned something really, really important. And also, Janet wrote something there. They are a guide to behave in a right way. Muy importante también. Uh, the core values I consider like a map that we need to follow in order to reach our goal and objective. <coughs> Uh, Gabriela, do you want to say something about? No? Okay. Don't, don't worry. Okay. Vamos a leer que escribió Gaby. To work in harmony, values are very important. And not, y se no cerró. And not describe anyone. Ah, aquí quizás quiso poner. Discriminar. Um, yes. Ah, ok, ok, ok. Se le, se le fue ahí en español. Ok, don't worry about. Ok, let us continue with the third question. Ok, do the company's value impact employees and how I we already talked about this? Ya hablamos un poco sobre... Eh, los valores de la compañía cómo impactan en sus empleados because if they promise you something and at the end of the month if you reach your goal but they don't give you the reward that means that they are not following the right way you know si una compañía le ofrece a sus empleados eh, un bono, una recompensa al final del mes y él lo alcanza y no se lo da, entonces, ¿qué, qué valor es el que no está cumpliendo? Ahí. Ok, we have innovation. Let us talk about some core values. We have trust, we have walls, we have teamwork, and also responsibility. You already talked about this. Which one of this one uh, do you practice in your company? ¿Cuáles de estos considera usted que practican en sus empresas? Just tell me. Hello. En lo de abajo, teacher, está incompleto o esos muñequitos que... ¿Qué quieren decir? Ok, let, let, me, let me adjust a little bit. Déjeme ver un poco acá. Vamos a ver qué pasó ahí con la imagen. Ok. 
Hold on a second. Yes, it is, it, it is talking about... Okay, hold, hold on a second. The dog is barking there. Wow, 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 wow. That dog Teacher, is... the microphone. Yeah, yeah, the dog is barking. Sí, ese será un micrófono de alguien. Pero ya lo cerramos. No era el mío, no era el mío. Even though there got some pecs here, but they are far away from here. Okay, as you can see, uh, what Gabriela asked about. Okay, and this one is showing, what, what can you infer about the meaning of this picture? Equality. Justice, equality. Okay, yes, equality. It's, it's equality. That, that means that everybody's going to be treated in the same way. No preferences. Yeah. And also, uh, when you got something uh, in the right way, somebody's going to say congratulations. You got, you got uh, to the right point. Dog again, dog again. Por ahí está otro. Están enojados los, las mascotas por ahí. Tenemos que mutearlas. Okay, that is the reason why we got the name core values because it's the base of everybody behave. Okay, who, who wants to read this concepts? I need a volunteer who wants to do it. Me gustaría tener un voluntario que me lea el significado de core values. Eh, Ingrid, por favor, do it, please. Core values are the fundamental beliefs of a person or organization. This guiding, no sé. <laughs> guiding, guiding. Guiding. Principles. Next. Principles. Dictate. Behavior. Behavior. And can help people understand the difference between right and wrong. Okay, thank you. I'm going to read again core values are the fundamental belief of a person or organization. Hay un punto ahí. Son las creencias fundamentales de una persona o una compañía. Si en su empresa, organización, o como usted le quiera llamar, la prioridad es el cliente, ah, entonces deben de haber valores relacionados con el cliente. ¿Sí? Okay, uh, this guiding principle dictate behavior and can help people understand the difference between right and wrong. Estas guías eh, principalmente nos dicen la forma de comportarnos y nos ayudan a las personas a entender la diferencia entre lo bueno y lo malo. Oiga bien, dependiendo de los valores que cada uno de nosotros tengamos, que nos hayan enseñado, así vamos a diferenciar entre el bien y el mal. Si lo que le estoy haciendo a mi compañero de trabajo no está correcto, al final allá la conciencia no tiene dientes, pero va a morderle. Entonces, that means that uh, you are practicing core values. Okay, next. Somebody else wants to read the next one? El siguiente párrafo, por favor, alguien más lo lee. Hola. Uh, it... Me, teacher. Okay. Core values also, also help companies to determine if they are on the right 
path and fulfilling their goals by creating an unwavering guide. 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 Okay, I'm, I'm going to read it for you. Okay, thanks. Okay. Uh, core values also help companies to determine if they are on the right path and fulfilling their goals by creating an unwavering guide. What does it mean? ¿Qué, qué, ¿Qué nos dice eso? Los valores fundamentales también ayudan a las compañías a determinar si ellos están en el camino correcto. Ah, ok. ¿Qué más? Si cumplen con sus objetivos, quizás. Ah, ok. Fulfill the worlds. Eso es muy bien. Fulfill the worlds and create an unwavering guide. ¿Esa palabra qué significa? Unwavering. Ahí, ahí tiene, esa palabra tiene eh, un, un prefijo que sería an. Sí. Ahí tiene un prefijo. ¿Qué significa wait? Solo la palabra wait o waiver. Y luego sabemos que ya la preposición la hace eh, diferente, ¿no? Hola, hola. Hola. Hola, dice. Sí. What is the meaning? Unwavering. Inquebrantable. Ah, okay. By creating an unwavering guide. Sí. Si está yendo en el car en el camino correcto, está cumpliendo sus The objetivos. Pronunciation? Unwavering guide. That is a meaning. Unwavering guide. Teacher. Hello. Uh, sorry. Es um, obligatorio que vaya toda la palabra. Unwavering guide. Para que diga inquebrantable, o solo esta, o solo la palabra eh, sería inquebrantable. Es que como acá tiene ya el, 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 el prefijo. Pero no es necesario guide. No, es que ahí se está refiriendo a la, la palabra guide sería ya como, como la guía, como el mapa. La guía. Sí, como, como algo que nos va guiando hacia el al path correcto, o sea, al camino correcto. Ok, ok, thank Por, you. Porque esa palabra unwavering también la puede hallar combinada con, con, con otra cosa. Unwavering values, por ejemplo, valores inquebrantables podría ser también. Ok. I, I, I invite you to write down all those words and create your own vocal for this class. Le recomiendo que todas estas palabras que van apareciendo así, vaya creando su propio vocabulario para que luego vaya usted usándolas y, y dentro de su, su, su léxico. Porque acuérdese, se llama inglés para el trabajo. 
Y eh, ya de este nivel para allá comenzamos a ver bastantes palabras que antes no se habían visto o que tenían otro significado. Okay, let us continue then. Uh, we already talked about what uh, core values are. Okay, listen to your teacher, read the conversation, then practice with the pattern. Yo creo que con lo que he mostrado sobre los core values ya hemos dado como un amplio concepto de ellos. Okay, right now let us uh, practice this conversation. Ahora hacemos esta conversación between Mario and Teresa. Okay. I am bio. Okay, we are going to do something different today. Vamos a hacer algo diferente hoy. Antes de que yo lo lea, I invite you to read it. I'm going to give you two minutes. Les voy a dar dos minutos para que ustedes la lean. Cada uno. Eh, and later on, I'm going to read it. Y luego yo la voy a leer. Okay, I invite you to do it now, please. Okay, I'm going to read it now. Okay, do you receive a newsletter about core values of the company? I did. It's a great idea to remember why we are different from other companies. What do you mean? I mean, we know innovation, efficiency, and respect should be part of our customer service. I see your point. We know about the values of the company, but maybe we don't apply them exactly. We should lead the values that make us different from other companies. Really interesting, this conversation. Okay, I'm going to read again. Lo voy a leer una vez más. Did you receive uh, a new newsletter about the core values of the company? I did. It's a great idea to remember why we are different from other companies. What do you mean? I mean, we know innovation, efficiency, efficiency and respect should be part of our customer service. I see your point. We know about the values of the company, but maybe we don't apply them exactly. We should lead the values that make us different from other companies. Okay, questions? Questions? Teacher, repeat, efficiency. Aficion, si dijo, parece. Which one? Repeat efficiency, please. E efficiency. Efficiency. Yes. Innovation. Innovation.
Apply, don't apply, don't apply the end. Okay, what else? Uh, what is the pronunciation of newsletter? Newsletter, newsletter, newsletter. Okay. And the meaning? This is como la 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 nueva cómo le diría como como la 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 última información referente a los valores de la compañía el último informe podría ser generally uh, sometime uh, in big companies uh, administration used to send letters newsletter to the employees in order to show them uh, Something that is really important to dance, you know. Es como que se re si recibió la carta sobre los valores de la compañía. That could be in some words. Ok, yo lo comprendía como noticia, pero... Uh... Sí, podría ser así. Podría ser como una noticia, como un memorándum, incluso... All, all, the, all depend of the context. Okay, thanks. Okay. But at the end, uh, it's like uh, synonyms, you know. Porque generalmente nosotros en el medio nuestro, las noticias, ¿cómo las recibimos? Television yeah. or... or maybe uh, for another ways, you know, social media or something like that. But in, in, in the case of our job, it's different. Pero en el caso de información eh, que tiene que ver con nuestro trabajo, lo recibimos a través de, de memorandum, a través de, de diferentes medios. Uh, by emails. Yeah, could be in email, emails too. That's correct. Okay. Somebody else? Alguien más? Any questions so far from here? Aprovechemos. No, teacher. Aprovechemos, por favor. Eh... Uh, teacher? Hello. Can you repeat? Did you receive or... Okay, did, yes. did, did you receive, did you receive a, new, a newsletter about the core values of the company? I did, it's a great idea to remember why we are different from other companies. What do you mean? Listen here, what do you mean? Or maybe you can say, what do you mean? Both ways are correct. Ambos, ambas pronunciaciones son correctas, pero es más americana when, when I say, what do you mean? Instead of say, what do you mean? Okay, I mean, we, we know innovation, efficiency, and respect should be part of our customer service. I see your point. We know about the values of the company, but maybe we don't apply them. Ah, okay. Entiendo tu punto, lo veo, sí. Sabemos acerca de los valores de la compañía, pero quizá nosotros no los aplicamos. Exactamente. We should leave the values that make us different from other companies. Debemos de practicarlos, de vivir los valores que nos hacen diferentes de otras compañías. Ok, Edwin, Edwin Alexis tiene mano arriba. Sí, pues, eh, solamente para notificarle que aquí en la zona pues ha venido más fuerte el agua y por cualquier cosa si no me viera pues es por ello ok, ok, I got you ok, ok, don't worry ok, uh, take a screenshot please hagamos una captura por favor de esta conversación so we are going to practice
just let me know as soon as you have it. Not yet. Okay, I'm going to stop shooting. Where did the laptop? Uh, and I need to create the breakout room. We have like 19 participants. Let me check out here. I'm going to create nine, and one is going to be three. Si los oyentes no se pueden conectar y le corresponde a usted con uno de ellos, wait a little minute there because I need to move. Let me give me the chance to adjust the groups. Okay. Si les corresponde con alguien que está de oyente, no se no abandone. Espérenme un par de minutitos ahí para poder hacer el cambio y que usted pueda hacer la práctica. Okay, let me see if I may not just enough. Okay, here we go. Please accept, accept the Teacher, me salí, me puede asignar de nuevo. Let me see what can I do for you. Gabi, Gabi, ¿qué le pasó, Gabi? Por ejemplo, que la pantalla... Ya no le oí, ya no le oí, ya, ya no le oí, ya no le oí, Gabi. No le oí. Toqué la pantalla, toqué la pantalla y me sacó. ¿Really? No me dio la opción. Ah, ok. I was trying to talk with somebody, but it was difficult. As soon as I get into, uh, I got into the into the breakout room, I didn't find anybody there. Estaba tratando de entrar con alguien que estaba solo, pero cuando ya llegué, es, ya no estaba ahí.
we got three in this one. Okay. Okay, welcome back. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Okay, let us start now. Who wants to be the first one? Let me check. Let, let, let me look for someone here. What about you, Janet? Okay. It will be Mario. Uh, did you receive a newsletter? <laughs> Or values of the company. I did. Yeah, I did. Who can make your wife special for all of the fun? What do you mean? I mean with work innovation, efficiency, and respect. So it works for constantly serve. I see your point. We know about the values of the company, but maybe we don't apply them. We should leave the values that make us different from other companies. Hello? Okay, thank you. Someone else, please. Next, next. Who's next? Roxana. <laughs> Uh, I am first. Uh, did you receive a newsletter about the core value of the company? I did. It's a great idea to remember why we are different from other companies. But what do you mean? I mean, we know innovation, ef efficiency, and respect should be part of our customer service. I see your point. We know about the values of the company, but maybe we don't apply them. Exactly. We show like the values that make us different from other companies. Okay, thank you. Next. Next. Me, teacher. Okay. Okay, go ahead. Uh, no sé si mi pareja se desconectó porque dijo que estaba lloviendo en su área. Okay, maybe somebody else can help give you a hand in order that you can do it. Si no está él o ella, alguien más puede ayudarle. O 
Okay, who wants to? Who wants to? Uh, can I try again? Yes, you can do it. Okay. Um, thank you. Uh, I start. Oh, okay. Did you receive Receive. A newsletter about the core values of the company? I did. It's a great idea to remember why we are the different. Sorry. I did. It's it's a great idea to remember why we are different from other companies. What do you mean? I mean, we know innovation, efficiency, and respect should be part of our customer service. I see your point. We know about the values of the company, but maybe we don't apply them. Exactly. We show live the values that make us different from other companies. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Okay, you're welcome. Thank you. Okay, somebody else? Someone else today is me, teacher. Okay. Can you okay. hear me? Okay, Jonathan. I went to try with Esmeralda. Okay, Esmeralda. Where is Esmeralda? Esmeralda, are you there, Esmeralda? Yes, teacher, but it's raining hard. Wow, oh, okay. Uh, do you listen? To yes, me? yes, yes, yes. Yes, okay, okay. You are Mario and I, Teresa. Yes, my Excuse me? You are star. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, did you recite a newsletter about the core values of the company? I did. It's a great idea to remember why we are different from other companies. What do you mean? I mean, we know innovation, efficiency, and respect should be part of our customer service. I see your point. We know about the values of the company, but maybe we don't update them. Exactly. We should like the values that make us different from other companies. Thank you, Esmeralda. Thank you. Thank you. Don't forget the word. Okay, let me show you here again. I'm going to tell you something related with the word. Let me get bigger here. Okay, don't 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 forget the pronunciation of this word. Did you receive? Did you receive? Receive. Don't get confused about this word, please. Can you hear me? Yes. Hello. Hello. Yes. Yes, it's true. Yes, teacher. Okay, okay. Receive, receive. It is la um like in this one. I don't know if you can hear exactly the way that I pronounce. When I read it, and I say, I mean, we know innovation, our efficiency. And respect should be part of our customer service. Efficiency. Okay, any questions so far from here? Alguna pregunta hasta acá? No? Hello? No, teacher. No teacher. No teacher. Okay. No teacher. Okay. Okay. Let us continue then. We are going to switch a little bit about uh, the activity that we are going to perform right now. 
um, you are going to do it by yourself and later on we are going to do it together. Or maybe, uh, well, let me share it. And we can resolve right here together. Okay, let us talk about uh, values. And what you are going to do is the following. You are going to look for the concept for each value. For example, honesty. We need to look for the concept of honesty. Just tell me if you have it. You need to read in order to know exactly where the concept of honesty is. Okay, I'm going to give you some minutes in order that you can read it. Let us start with honesty. We got the concept there. Do you hear me? Yes, sir. Uh, the quality of being fading fruitful, fruitful. Are you talking uh, about are, are you talking about this one? Uh, number five. Number five. Ah, about this one? Yes. Okay, hold on a second. I'm going to put it here. You say that honesty is the same like quality of being fair and truthful. Ah, okay. What about, uh, let us look for the conscious of empathy. Empathy. The ability to understand how some Okay, yes. Could you give me, could you give me the number? One, two, three, four, two. five. Number two. Number three, teacher. Okay, number two or number three? Number two. You three. Say, you say number two and somebody else say three. Okay, at the end, we are going to move Sonos then. You say, being faithful to your friend, family, principal, etc. Ah, uh -huh. okay, let us see number three. Okay, don't number two, number two. Number two or number three. You have no, the... number two. Mm. Number three, teacher. The ability to understand how someone feels. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. How can I do in order in this case? Let me see if I put it here. And I mod this one. Let us see. Let us see. Okay, hold on a second. The ability to understand how someone feels. Uh-huh. Okay. That is empathy. Somebody else think different. En español la empatía es que ponerse en los zapatos del otro. Ah, okay. And what about in English? Será being honest and behaving according to the model that you believe or the ability to understand how someone feels? Oh, well. Okay, let us continue and then we, you can move it, okay? Integrity. Integrity. Number five. This one? Five. Yeah. Okay. okay, let us see. Being, being honest and fair and behaving according to the model principle that you believe in. Okay, integrity. Okay, if somebody said different, 
let, let us let us know, please. Okay, leadership, leadership. 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 Number five, teacher. Number five, this one. Let me see. Being good at leading a group, organization, and country, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Okay. What about punctuality? Number five. Number five. Let yes. us. Okay, let me put it here. Arriving or being done at exactly time that has been arranged. Okay, that is punctuality. Innovation. It's number one. Number one. Okay, the introduction of new ideas, methods, or inventions. Okay, what about responsibility? Responsibility. Number one. Number one? Yes. The, the quality of being dependable? Okay, as soon as we finish, you can move Sonos then, if you want, okay? Uh, efficiency. Which one? Number two. Number two. Okay, let me move number two here. Okay, let us read it. Doing something well and effectively with the wasting time, money, or energy. That is efficiency. Ah, okay. Pretty good. What about respect? Number two. Number one. Okay, number one or number two? Just let me know. Okay, somebody said number one. Okay, I'm going to put it here. The ability, okay, I'm going to put this one right here. I'm going to give you three minutes in order that you read it and tell me before summit answer, I can move. Okay, le doy un par de minutos para que lea todos los conceptos y si alguien tiene alguna duda o me dice, mire, cambie este por este porque no es así. Okay, we have the chance to do it now. I'm going to give you two minutes, two minutes to do it, to read it. Only two minutes, no more than two minutes. Teacher. Hello. It's raining. Cut and up, teacher. I got it. I got it. I know what you mean. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Okay. Tell me. Tell me if we need to move some concert to a different place. Just let me know, please. Bueno, son 19. Tiene que salir bueno. Todos están dando su aporte. Teacher. Hello. Can you repeat responsibility concept? Okay, hold on a second. Responsibility. The quality of being dependable. The quality of being dependable. Thank you. 
Okay. Are you going to switch Sonos in or not? Just let me know. Van a hacer algún cambio? Yes or not? If not, I'm going to submit answers. Algún cambio? No? No. No. Okay, let us, let us check. Vamos a checar entonces a ver si estamos bien. Here we go. Cross your finger, cross your finger. Do you know what is that? ¿Sabes lo que es eso, cierto? Yes? Cruzar los dedos. Cross your finger, okay. Here we, here we go. My goodness, you got everything pretty good. Ah, you got 10 out of 10. Okay, I'm going to show you again. Voy a mostrarlo una vez más por si alguien quiere hacer una captura. Okay, you got it there. Ahí los tienes por si quieres hacer una captura. Yeah? Yes? No yet? Okay, I'm going to step a little bit. Let me see the time that we have now. Okay, let, let me see. Uh, let me see what do you think about this exercise? ¿Qué le pareció el ejercicio? Aburrido, me va a decir. Muchas letras, me va a decir. El silencio habla por sí solo. Eh, ¿Puede ser en español? Yes, you can say in Spanish. Eh, sí, estuvo bonita la dinámica porque trabajamos más en equipo. Ah, ok, perfecto. Una salvó al grupo, Ingrid, porque el resto está quieto. I don't know why. Ah, ok, ahí está Janet, ahí está Janet también, Janet, salvando, salvando, salvando al equipo, salvando al equipo. Me gustó, teacher. Ah, ok. Bueno, ya van un par que dijeron que sí les gustó. Posiblemente alguno va a decir no, no me gustó. Bueno, tratamos de cocinar para que a todos les agrade, pero siempre va, habrá alguien que dirá que no. Que le hizo falta y que aquí... Pero bueno, ahí vamos. Hola, hola. I, I understand that. It's, it's, it's really dif difficult to, to hear exactly what I'm saying in some areas. Also, El Salvador is raining cat and dogs. I know that. Okay, let us continue then. Vamos a continuar. Okay, what about exercise number four? Add two of your company's values to the box. Then run the top five values that should be part of any company's culture. Compare your result with a pattern. We have uh, eight different values here, and you are going to add two more. Aquí tenemos ocho valores, y usted va a agregar dos más. Then, as soon as you add it, tan pronto los agregue, you are going to rank the top five values that should be part of any company culture. Luego usted lo va a clasificar 
en un orden del 1 al 5 para mostrar cuáles son los cinco que deberían de ser parte de la cultura de una compañía. So, you have five minutes to do this. Go ahead now. The first thing that you need to do is just to add two more values here. Lo primero que tiene que hacer es agregar dos valores más. And then you are going to start ranking. Y luego lo puedo ordenar del mayor al menor, que sería el 5. El número 1 será el que tiene más valor. Ok, go ahead now, please. Tell me sober, tell me sober, tell me, tell me, please. I don't know if you want to take a screenshot because later on you need to read it. Teacher. Hello. Yeah, from one to five. Yes. Okay, but, but before you do it, I'm going to read again efficiency, integrity. Innovation, loyalty, respect, responsibility, punctuality, service to others. Service to others. Okay, I need that you share your information. Who wants to do it? Raise your hand if you want to do it. Quien quiera hacerlo, levanta su mano, por favor. Sergio, share a file in the meeting. Let us see what is the file about. Veamos que compartió, que compartió. Okay. Uh, Sergio, I don't know if, uh, if you know that you can share your info. Also, if you want to do it right here, if you are in a computer, I can give you the chance to share the information. 
only uh, share your screen and your and your info is going to appear for all of us right here. Si alguien está en un ordenador o en una computadora puede hacer la compartir su pantalla si es que lo trabajó digitalmente. De esa manera podemos uh, compartir la información. Hola, hola. Anybody there? Okay, Janet. Tell us, Janet. Number five, innovation. Innovation. Okay, thank you. Okay, okay, thank you. Thank you, Janet. Okay, somebody else, please. Alguien más, por favor? Me, teacher. Okay, uh, Jonathan. Number one, uh, leadership okay, and lead passion, teacher. Okay. And my ranking the value, respect, punctually, integrally, responsibly, and efficiently, teacher. Okay, uh, I'm going to repeat again. Voy a repetirlo una vez más para que se graben las pronunciaciones. Efficiency, integrity or integrity, innovation, loyalty respect, responsibility, punctuality, service of other. Okay, thank you. Okay, next one, somebody else, please. Alguien más, por favor. Uh, me, teacher, and okay. I, I added, added the teamwork and leadership values. Okay, value, values, values. Values, values, okay. 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 Uh, number one, uh, integrity. integrity. Number two, innovation. Innovation. And innovation. Uh, number three, responsibility. Responsibility. Number four, service to others. And number five, Leadership. Okay, number five is leadership. Pretty good. Okay, thank you. Somebody else? Someone else? Someone else? Someone else, please? Me, teacher. Okay, go ahead. Uh, I added, added uh, honesty and teamwork. Okay. Uh, for me, uh, Values, the top five values is uh, art, uh, number one, respect. Okay. Number two, uh, efficiency. Number three, honesty. Number four, innovation. Number five, integrity. Okay. Perfect. Thank you. Someone else? Alguien más, por favor. Me, teacher. Okay, Hector. Okay. Uh, my rank is honesty. Honesty is the first one. Respect. Respect is the second one. Re responsibility. Responsibility, number uh, three. Innovation. Innovation, number four. And service to others. And service to all this number five. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, I guess time is over. Let me see the time that we have now. Bueno, hemos llegado al tiempo. Okay, I don't know if somebody have any questions so far from here. Alguien tenga alguna pregunta hasta acá.
todavía nos quedó algo ahí en el tintero, que es el ejercicio 5 de, de la página 14. Usted la puede realizar. Sí, en la página 5, el ejercicio 5, perdón, dice complete the sentences below with one of the values from the box B and compare your answer with a pattern. And another activity that you can realize is uh, prepare a two-minute presentation about the impact of the uh, core values of your company on the personnel. Include yeah. at least five values. Use example to show how people in your company apply those values. That could be also another activity that you can perform. Okay, hold on a second, please. I need to check out the attendance. Okay, necesitamos revisar la asistencia. Okay, America, say hello, America. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Carlos. Present. Okay, Cecilia. Present teacher. Edwin. Present teacher. Okay. Um, don Edwin Alfredo. Don Edwin Alfredo. El director de Criótico. Sí, ¿verdad? Okay. Uh, Esmeralda. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Gabriela is there. Present teacher. Okay, Gisela. Giselle. Hello, Giselle. It's not here. Okay, Hector. Present teacher. Okay, Ingrid. Present. Jonathan. Present teacher, present. Oh, okay, thank you, Jose Ernesto. Catherine Paola. Candy. Present teacher. Mauricio Antonio. Present teacher. Okay, sir. Two. Eh, teacher, no sé si está pasando lista ya, pero yo no le escucho nada. Pero I am here, soy Gisela. Ah, ya llamé a Gisela. No me oyó Gisela. Okay, eh, let me see. Habíamos llegado hasta donde Marcela. No, Gisela. No, ya, ya, ya. I got you. No, me había quedado en Marcela. Sí, me regresé. Okay. Me regresé a ver a Gisela. Sí, ya está. Ok. Ok. Roxana. Roxana Álvarez. Say hello. Present teacher. Ok. Roxana Elizabeth. Present. Sara. Present teacher. Sergio. Present. Janet. Present teacher. Yesenia Lisset. Okay, that's it. Let me see how many people is missing today. Just two. Bueno, vamos mejorando. Ahora solo faltaron dos. Dos personas. Eso es importante. Sergio tenía mano arriba. I don't know if you have any questions so far from here, Sergio. Teacher, yo en la página 13 y 14 tengo otra info. Really? Sí, tengo lo que vimos hace en la clase del jueves. Hold on a second. Estoy otro, otro libro. Permítame un segundito, por favor. Teacher, al WhatsApp no pueden mandar la información del, del nuevo material. Sí, ahí está, col ahí está, col ahí está colgado. Good night, ah, teacher. Ok, good night, bye bye, take care.
Bueno, por ahí voy a... Good night, teacher. Good night, good night, good night. Bye. Good night. Ok, good night. Good night, teacher. Good night, bye bye. Have a good night, teacher. Ok, thank you. Good night, teacher. Night. Okay, let, let me check out the, uh, yeah, I got a mistake here. It's 11 and 12. Es página 11 y 12. 11 y 12. I'm sorry. Oh, okay, let's say hello. Okay, okay, I, I got That's confused. It. I got confused with that, but I already checked it. I do really apologize about that. On, yeah, 11 and 12, 11 and 12. That is the info. Great, thanks. Okay, Thank okay. Good, good night, take care, bye-bye. Good night. Okay, good night.